What it do, YouTube? This is Jamel King TV. I'm back with another video. Taking a vlog and vlog and vlog and vlog and vlog while I'm driving, you know? Currently, I'm driving the Alpina B7. Um, peep this. I ain't been myself in a long time, you know? <clears throat> and I'm getting a lot of emails out there saying, and a lot of messages saying, yo, why you ain't doing no more motivation vid videos? Why you that pushing? Uh. As y'all can see, this is no cap. I've been up since yesterday. I'm real tired. I've been driving. You know, that's what I do to make a living. Drive. We live and we learn. Um, I'm in Buffalo right now, so I'll be go coming to Rochester. Going back and going to Rochester on my way back. But anyways, you can never overthink where you're going to be at in life or what you're going to do in life because life makes you right that's what y'all think no you make life you life don't make you you make life if you let life make you you're gonna be old drained drenched all of that good stuff you're gonna be falling apart now if you make life the what it is you're gonna live it like i got a daughter right if i don't push this and get this shit for my daughter she'll never know my daughter three years old she doesn't know what her father does to put that house on they don't know my baby mom do. My daughter does not know what I go through, what sacrifices I take, how I take, and what I do. I do it for her. If I did it for me, I wouldn't give a two shits about it. Look it, I got the best, best family ever, man. My dad, you know, when when I kick it with my dad, it's like a relief for me, man, because I be wanting to tell my dad so much shit. And it's like, my body's so drained. When I want to talk to him about, he got his own problems and guess what we almost identical to the same stuff he going through i'm going through i don't want to keep pounding stuff on people and not taking advantage of life you know i'd rather bury my dad than my dad bury me that's the saying of shit should go but right lately that father's burying their own kids i don't want my dad to bury me i want my daughter to bury me and I want to bury my father. My daughter going to bury me when I go, you know. Um, if I do go, my daughter never had to work ever in her life again. I'm set up like that. I'm set my daughter up to never fail, push harder, and get to it. My daughter, I love her to death. She never in her million years on this planet going to have to work for anybody if I ever go. She's not going to struggle. She might be hurt without me, but she was not going to struggle without me. While I'm gone, <clears throat> she going to keep hope in life. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm going to make sure everything is bigger and better. I'm telling you, I'm going to make sure everything is best for my daughter. You know, I want more kids, but I don't want more kids. You know why? You, you don't pick the right choices when people have kids. They just having kids just to have them. I'm having kids to help push forward in their minds, you know. <clears throat> I always want to push, push, push. But everybody don't do this. They don't do, do, do. I'm a doer, not a pusher. I like to do it. If I pushed it, uh, you don't get the best results. If I do it, you're going to get great results in that. And uh, my sister, you know, you gotta, you gotta love your sisters. You know what I'm saying? I got this one sister. All she do, she a fighter, she a shit talker, and she don't give a fuck like her brother. That's part of life. You can't give a fuck. If I stop giving a fuck, if I started giving a fuck, I'd be torn out. When you don't give a fuck, you live, you live better. When you don't give a fuck, I'm here to tell y'all, don't give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? Your life going to change. And I'm tired. When I say I'm tired of this, listen. I want a woman to cook, clean, do everything. Right? I have one. But do she do that? No. She get in her ways. She get tired. She get stuck. Listen. If you got a job that <clears throat> lets you do what you got to do. If I had a job sitting at home all day, the house would be spick and span. Yo. Know, food on the table. I, my man come home, he get in the shower, I put my, put my mouth all over him, 
give him any type of pussy he want if I was a chick, and my man wanted that, I'ma give him that. My man want a Chinese bitch, I dress Chinese. My man want an African bitch, I'ma dress African. That's how I do if I was a woman. See, women don't think like that now. They think, oh, he's cheating on me. Oh, he talking to the next person. Oh, he talking to that person. Why would a man step out on a relationship? Talk to me, people. If a man step out on a relationship, he ain't getting something at the house, is he? Something's not happening at the house for your man to motherfucking want to go talk to another bitch or, or be in another bitch's face or, or, um, what's that word I'm looking for? Or entertaining someone. You don't entertain people that don't want to be entertained. And I always tell people, my baby mom thinks that, oh, you in these bitches' face. Oh, you doing that to these bitches. If I was getting what I'm getting at home, if I was getting the right shit at home, <clears throat> I wouldn't need to ask a bitch what a woman should do if she had a man. You bitches don't understand me. Now, let me clear this up. For all y'all gonna see this video, worldwide, multi-million people, do not, do not, that's what I'm gonna tell you, do not do. Do not think no man is gonna sit at a home and not getting what he get to go cheat. It ain't cheating. I'm asking my homie. I told my homegirl, yo, shit, my homegirl's a good bitch. I ain't gonna ever hold you. She good. A nigga will wait two, three years for that type of bitch. And the ones that we got currently ain't about nothing, doing nothing. Come on now. But it's always a man fault. Two can play that game, remember that. Two can play that motherfucking game. And people don't realize the shit we go through. We go through more shit than anybody. We got feelings too, ladies. We got feelings. But y'all don't see that. Y'all just think one way and one way only. We ain't thinking with our dicks all the time. Oh, we gonna fuck this bitch. We gonna do that to this bitch. We don't think like that. Why we gotta think like that? Thinking like that is stupid. I'm here to tell y'all, you know what? I might get off that subject because that can get real sensitive right now. Because um, I'm a living testimony. I'm telling you that right now, people. We live, we learn. Ooh, that's a touchy subject. Ooh, ooh. Hey, I'm telling you, I'm shooting this video today. It's coming out today. Picture this, y'all. I'm coming to see my cousin around because I'm pulling up on you. Gee, shit. I need a prayer. I need I need somebody to lay some hands on me because um, I ain't living right. It's the it's a devil in my house. I got to I got to do something to get that devil. I got to have somebody come bless the house. <laughs> I got to have the house blessed. Amen. Drive so damn far away, right? This is motivation, man.